Hi, this is Himagiri and I am currently pursuing my MBBS from Philippines. Basically, this video is regarding what is the future of Philippines. Means whether we can study your MBBS in future for future generations, or what is the current situation? I mean, what is the current situation of BS or MD in India? What you had went recently? Okay, let's start this video with a small intro. Hi guys. We are near by 300 subscribers. If you keep supporting like this, and I will share very very important updates which I am getting from Philippines or other consultancies, and keep supporting forever with your love. Basically, Philippines is thinking regarding three plans due to NMC, and those plans are Plan A, Plan B, Plan C, and I will explain in detail regarding what is Plan A and what is Plan B and what is Plan C. Plan A is to put a case with our consultancies regarding what is the main theory or main purpose of studying MBBS in Philippines, and asking for some more justice because banning Philippines completely is not a right decision for future generations because education is global and no one can stop it, right? That is the main scenario of Plan A. I mean, the main scenario is once again I am saying. to put a case in some of the courts of india and asking for some justice because stopping a uh, banning education permanently it's not a right way a right path to choose like that right okay let's move to plan b what is plan b is reducing the duration of bs basically the bs duration is 1 year 6 months right now and coming to ap psychology it is somewhat 1 year and 1.5 years based in colleges and bs duration also seems to be 1.5 years in some colleges and 2 years in some colleges so what they were do i mean their philippines is planning to do is reducing the bs duration now the bs seems like a four three semesters plus one summer totally four now they are reducing that three semesters to two semesters plus one summer basically the semester duration is three months now they are reducing to two and half months or two months and they are leaving the 15 days for enrollment Uh, enrollment purpose. And finally, three months, three months. It's nearly six months. And the duration of summer course is one month. Means summer is basically one to two months, right? And this course also seems like uh, one or two months course. So no need to worry. So basically, the duration of, I mean, the total duration of BS is only eight months. I mean, this is the plan they are thinking, but if plan A fails to be implemented. they may implement plan b but i can't give 100% assurance because what they are thinking i am getting information so i am sharing that information with you coming to md what nmc says is i mean they are ordering philippines government to change the rules and regulations to four and off years mbbs or md what is the main purpose of changing four and off years md means they are saying that you are indians will get some more pure knowledge compared it to filipinos and other countries so why can't you make that to 4.5 years therefore the philippines is ready to accept that 4.5 years because philippines is planning to drain some more money because increasing the duration will increase some more fees right so increasing fees will some more lesser compared to this present duration because if they increase the Uh, fees for md the complete package will be much more heavier so they are reducing the fees of ps and increasing that add and i mean adding that amount to md therefore they are increasing 3 years md i mean 3 years md plus 1 year internship right remove that 1 year internship and basically md is 3 years and 1 year they will call as clerkship so remove that clerkship aside now at present they are 3 3 years and they are adding one and off year to that 3 year so basically it is called as four and off year course or 48 months i mean i don't know exactly what how much duration they are planning but they will implement soon that's what i am trying to say they and you may ask a question that increasing that one and off year will cause a full a great damage means uh, i will say that it doesn't cause a much more damage to you right because increasing one year will give you a much more preparation time for next i mean fmg was replaced by next right so they are giving a much more time for next so if you use that time very very preciously you can crack an next in single attempt and you will get some more some more more marks compared to indians 
and you will settle with a better position and you may get a seat in pg in india also right and they are planning and they are planning not to add any extra course but they are planning to keep a fast track revision and complete that i mean to revise that four years within a duration of eight months i mean they will make that three years in a slow process and they will add some indian subjects to to their md and later on what they will do is reduce the size of i mean they will strengthen the md to three years to it may be 3.3 years 6 months and they will keep a fast track batch for 8 to 12 months that's all basically increasing one month will not cause any severe damage because fmg percentage is 46% or 30% i mean 46% or 30% because it is changing with day to day or year to year basically 30% only for japans so if they increase the time that 30% will become to maybe 50 or 60 therefore you will get a huge benefit right and don't worry because don't worry the cost of living basically if you are thinking of planning for philippines it will cost nearly 35 lakh with minimum package and don't expect for 30 lakhs with what are the consultant says because i am experienced with that fake words what consultants were saying so don't listen their words what you want to do is just hold a 35 lakh amount and join to philippines but choose the right consultancy because choosing the right consultancy will give you some changes or some special qualities in philippines compared to other students with uh, which they are joining with other consultancies so what is plan c plan c should be implemented by your own because uh, no one will decide your future fate right you should recreate your own door for your success and you should get entered into it what is plan c plan c is going pg for abroad i think you know or you don't know i don't know actually mexico or canada are having very good relationship with philippines basically they are they are going to say as american system but philippines is having very good relationship with canada so if you want to pursue a can i mean after mbbs after md if you want to go canada just crack that license or exam and go to canada don't say that it is very tough or easy if you prepared with honest and sincerely no one can stop and no one can hold you back right so if you are honest surely success will support you and rather than canadian license or exam very very easy is i think so dubai license or exam and that's all dubai and canadian what i am thinking is they are much more easy and there is that australian medical license for exam but don't expect that it is very very easy because most of my friends said that it is was somewhat tough and the and what we are getting our knowledge in philippines right that is regarding us mle pattern so if you are perfect with first aid books what uh, what youtubers are suggesting to you then you may crack us mle also but us mle cracking us mle will ask you some more extra amount uh, extra efforts because spending much more time uh, compared to canadian license for exam okay i will explain regarding canadian license for exam in my next video and upcoming videos don't worry and i said that plan c na it should be implemented by your own that's all and don't argue with me that plan b is regarding because why they are going to change means i will say a small story that is actually true what happened that story is there is a body or an object called as nmc in india like that there is a object called as chad in philippines that chad is that chad said duration of bs is one year once upon a time but right now they are increased to 1.5 years because i mean what i mean to say is in the year of 2016 like that the bs duration is one year and they are increased to one and half year in the year of 2019 20 21 like that and they are increasing and they are they are planning to move away give a better education what they mean to say is and the subjects what were experiencing in bs don't i mean what i mean what i mean to say is those subjects are inter somewhat i mean plus 1 plus 2 and they are mbbs apart basically what you will experience is first semester and second semester seems like first semester matlab plus 1 second semester matlab plus 
एंड थर्ड सेमिस्टर मतलब एम डी फर्स्ट ईयर फोर्थ सेमिस्टर मतलब कम्युनिटी मेडिसिन वॉट यू आर एक्सपेंस आई मीन वॉट यू आर गोइंग टू एक्सपीरियंस इन यूर लोकेलिटी एंड डोंट आस्क मी रिगार्डिंग यू वी गुलवास बिकॉज यू वी गुलवास इज गोइंग आई मीन अवॉइडिंग चेट रूल्स एंड दे आर गोइंग अ पार्ट फ्रॉम चेट आई विल आई विल एक्सपेक्ट दैट दे आर ऑल्सो गोइंग टू मॉडिफाई दैट रूल्स सो डोंट वरी that's that what i that what i mean to say and that's all if you really like you can share it to your friends okay if you are having any queries you can comment if i am having time or if i had seen your comment surely i will reply it that's all okay bye